Hi there, my name is Frank Durfler and I'm both a writer and a reader of books that guys will like. And today I'd like to introduce you to a book by Bill O'Reilly along with Martin Duggard. It's called Killing Lincoln and of course it's about the assassination of Abraham Lincoln. Now the assassination of Lincoln has been studied by scholars, studied by policemen, studied by forensic experts, Poor Lincoln's been exhumed several times. So what new can we learn? Well, really, it's the format. The fact that O'Reilly and Duggard have put together a book that's easy to read, interesting, yet very, very clear and very, very true to the facts of the, of the case of the assassination. Essentially, it's a book about John Wilkes Booth, about the few days before the assassination, and it actually goes back and talks about some of the factors leading to the end of the Civil War, some of the conditions, the economic conditions and social conditions in the country that led to a plot like the one that John Wilkes Booth was involved in. Did you know, for example, that there were other attacks that took place during the same day and as a matter of fact, some at exactly the same time of Lincoln's assassination. So there are all kinds of interesting sidelights and stories that go along with it. There is insight into the character of Booth. There's insight, a lot of insight into the character of Lincoln. It's very accurate, yet it's an easy read. It's a book that you uh, would enjoy reading. It's a great gift for anyone who's interested in history. Anyone who's interested in a little bit of a, uh, a detective story, and you know what? It's particularly a good gift for anyone who might be going to Washington, D.C., because the setting is very, very detailed. It's a, it would be a great gift for someone who's going to Washington on a class trip because the settings around the Willard Hotel, the settings around the Ford's Theater, all of that very, very well described. So, Worth a read, certainly worth getting, a, uh, an interesting book that I would highly recommend. By the way, if you're interested in other books that are very true to history, very true to setting, and give you great information, I've written two. One is called A Glint in Time, now in its second edition, and the other is called A Twist in Time. Both A Glint in Time and A Twist in Time are available for every kind of electronic format, whether you read them on a PC, a laptop, a Kindle, a Nook, or whatever, they're available. A Twist in Time and A Glint in Time by me, Frank Durfler. Have a great day. Todd. Todd, is he going down with you? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Yes. You should read A Glint in Time. <laughs>